Well, what is up, YouTube? So for today's video, I'm doing a quick, short video. It's gonna be a mini grocery haul. So it's just gonna be a couple things I picked up from Audis. I don't really shop anywhere else except for like Audis and Publix and like the whole food store and stuff like that. But I'm kind of one arm in it today. So if you find that the camera angle is a little off or whatnot, that is why. So let's roll right into this video. I'm gonna show you you guys what I bought. So basically, here are all the items that I got at Audis. I spent maybe about $50 or so. Um, I didn't really need any specific items to cook with. I kind of just got a couple things um, to um, cook with and eat with uh, throughout the week. So basically, I'm just gonna roll right into what I got. So I got some diced tomatoes to do some spaghetti with later. Um, some black beans, some tomato soup, which I love tomato soup, and I like to put some diced tomatoes in my tomato soup because it's really good. And then I got my favorite, most favorite smoothie ever a brand, which is the Boathouse Farms. I love their smoothies. They're so really, really good. And they have a lot of sugar in them, but it's really, really good. It has like apple, uh, mango, and just all these wonderful things. And it's really cheap. It's the cheapest, the cheapest place you can buy it is at Aldi's. Like anywhere else is pretty expensive. And then also got some bananas, some grapes. I love me some grapes to snack on just like when I'm out and about. Like I said, um, I do go to school and I work, so I try to find quick things that I can grab and go and whatnot. And I got some pistachios. They're really good, but they are also expensive. Anywhere you go, they're kind of expensive. I think these were like um, $7 at all these, but you know what? I love them. I want them. I got them. <laughs> Okay, so for next, I got some squash to make some, um, probably some steamed vegetables with uh, later in the week. And then also I got some little rice uh, cake little snacks. I eat them um, in between um, driving and, and whatnot. And I got some vegetable chips. And I love these chips. They're really, really crunchy. They're really, really good. And what I like to do with my chips, I used to um, not put anything in my chips, but now, when I get my vegetable chips, I always put some nutritional yeast in it. It's so good. It's so much better than salt because I don't believe it has any salt on it. But it's really, really good and I love, love, love this stuff and it lasts forever. I use this on chips and then I use it for popcorn when I make popcorn on a stove and whatnot. It's really, really good though. Alright, back to my list of stuff. Okay, and then also I got some... um steamed broccoli to make with if I'm at work and I just forgot to pack my lunch or something like that because that does happen occasionally. And then I got some frozen blueberries to do some smoothies with and some sh uh, frozen strawberries to do some uh, smoothies with as well. I like to do a blueberry, strawberry, uh, banana, and spinach smoothie with my Nutribullet. Anyways, that's what I like to do. And I got some yogurt for in the morning, um, in the go, on the go. And then I got one of these um, veggie little hot pocket uh, resembling thing. But it's really good though. I've eaten it. I have eaten it before, and it's really good. Also, I got some cereal, uh, cranberry almond crunchy. It's really good. Really good. I love. Whenever I eat cereal, I love to have like a crunch in my cereal. I used to like it really soggy, like I used to get the, um, you know, the Rice Krispie treats or whatever. But anyway, and then also I got some diced peaches because I love peaches. And I know that this probably isn't the healthiest for you, but it's really quick for me. It's easy to um, just grab it and go. And then I also got some bake uh, chewy bars and these are super duper good they're the very berry uh, chewy bars and they're really good the only thing I do not like about them is that they are small but they're really good you know soy free nut free everything free and it's good it is is good <laughs> and then also I got some like one of these little frozen meals that you can put in the um in the microwave, whatever. I got two of those. They they are good. They're not the healthiest thing for you. Um, they have a lot of ingredients in it, but you know what? I eat healthy majority of the time, so I mean it's okay. Like I said, I'm not a strict vegetarian. I just like to you know accumulate majority 
of um, majority of most vegetables and fruits and stuff, which I do. I just kind of, you know, every now and then I do whatever. And then the last thing I got was some zucchini. And I'm going to steam those and make something with those. I'll probably um, put them on my pizza and stuff. But yes, that is all.